Hello viewers, welcome back. It's Madam Kuchiha. Today we're doing part 7 on Steven Universe Save the Light. We're going to be picking off back on the Strawberry Battlefield. Hello viewer, thank you for turning in. We are just starting out. We're going to be picking up back on the Strawberry Battlefield. Couldn't figure out which way to go exactly. So after the last stream from Saturday, I did my own research and now I know where to take us. So here we're going to start back off in the Temple Crater. Warp, 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 warp. Hello, hola to everybody. Bienvenidos. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. We have a f more than usual viewers. If you guys want, you guys can write down what's your favorite gem. Mine personally is Opal. I understand it's a fusion, but I think her outfit is really cool and her bow. You know, some others like Garnet because she's just that cool, apparently. <laughs> That's what I've been told. I like Garnet too. Alright, so... So yeah, I see that you're back, viewer. Thank you for jo joining in today. So, last time during the stream, I was getting very frustrated and not knowing where to go on the strawberry battlefield. But I actually did some research after our last stream, and it's actually up here, up on this battle axe. Sneaky, sneaky game designers. Excellent. That seems to be all the tungsten in this area. Onward to the next one. So it looks like we grabbed all the tungsten in this area. Now we're trying to get to the next part, and this is this is the way to the next part. This is why it was so difficult for me to find it. Oh, we got a badge, you guys. We got the kudos badge. Aids the kudos ability to wear his ability ring. When used, builds relationship points with selected target. This is great for us because when we want a fusion during battle, say like we want Pearl to fuse with Amethyst to make Opal, or Garnet to fuse with Amethyst to make Sugalite, if we have this badge on one of them, we can up the relationship meter bar. In the last stream, I explained the meter bar, the relationship meter bar to you guys. That, uh. You have to get your meter bar full to do a fusion. And then it'll pop up that you guys have the ability. So let's give this kudos badge. Let's give it a whirl. What's this? And then that badge that we just had on her. We could give it to Steven just in case. So he has a healing ability that really helps us out during battles. So if it costs zero points, that'd be good for us. Let's be sure not to fall on this. I just said that. Oh, I'm sorry for the viewers that speak Spanish. Um, ahorita estamos en el battlefield de fresa. <laughs> Recién puso un badge que eh, si le pones en una caricatura puede salzar el. Uh, relación contra esa caricatura y otro. Eso significa que puedes usar puedes usar fusion más rápido. Como que si le, ya le puse el badge en Pearl. Y si quiero que Pearl fuses, fuse con Amethyst para hacer Opal, ese me puede ayudar a hacer el meter bar que estamos hablando de ayer. You guys know where you're going, right? I love Pearl Spear. Me encanta el Spear de Pearl. All right, now that we found our, found the next location, we're finally here. So take note of that battle axe when you're in the in the temple crater. <laughs> That's it. 
this is enough to repair the terminal. So now we have enough tungsten. So that's good. And there, activate. Right, seems like we're about to be a, at a boss battle. Yay! So what does it say? Does it show where to find Hezonite? Indeed! Looks like she's at the Sky Arena. Hmm. That's a particular place for her to... Oh man, this one looks tough. It must be the great and terrible. Hmm. We can name him, you guys, so... Actually... Excala Crush seems really nice. <laughs> Excala Crush! He has a maze. Oh god. You don't have gone in. We're fine. I never knew that he had this ability. This one's for you. A special jam that gives Pearl a big attack and defense boost. So we can give this to her. Oh, and we have another ability for Pearl. Hol uh, hollow Pearl. Create a hollow pearl. Hollow pearl will constantly deal damage to select the target for a limited time. So let's go ahead and use the ability on Excala Crush. Uh, target is too high. Oh, there's different targets on this guy. Hollow pearl. Attack. All right, let's get some. Surprisingly, I don't have anyone that can fuse on my team right now. Not the best idea. Item, I choose you. Attack. How about this tasty number? Let's do a damage jam with Greg. Attacks on nearby targets continually over time. Targets closer to Greg take more damage. And he's getting close to Greg, so let's bubble him. Bloop. And then have Paradot. Uh, doesn't look like he's gonna be able to hit him, but let's do this one. Bloop. Let's see if we can push this guy back. Nope, but we are taking down his armor. up his health right now. Thing, thing. Hey! <laughs> hey! Attack. Wait. 
wait for it. There. Hey! Thrust. Jet powers activate! <laughs> no spoilers, please, for my viewers that haven't seen anything yet. Thrust. If only we had Garnet to taunt this guy. the helmet we can give Greg to up his defense. Yeah. yeah, we can give a little bit Do your thing, thing! together breakfast you add some health to the full party we actually could use Maybe it yeah. this? <laughs> but I get what you but I understand what you're saying that we need to attack the diamond of the Excali Crusher boss The diamonds in his head right now falls uh, the time. So everyone stays. Okay. There you go.
also to my viewers and for the stream itself the way we found the path to the next part to the boss through the X was because of my boyfriend Mod Madara Kachia, also the other person that's on this channel. Wanna say hi? Hello. Alright, that's him. So thanks to him, we found out the way to get to the next part of the mission. hard to attack the diamond on the boss because I can't don't have many moves to reach him like if I use pearl spear for instance this says target is too high the only move that I really do have is her spear throw her fireballs and peridot metal powers oh I do have great jam I don't even know if it'll reach him Okay, it was in the hand this time. No, you lost Steven. It's in his it's in his stomach now. Sorry, you guys. That took so long, too. <laughs> At least now we can actually go out and get some other gems so we can fuse. Time to quest with the best. I never doubted us for a second. If I'm not mistaken, there should be a warp pad up here. Okay. Let's find a warp pad, switch our characters, or switch out Greg and Peridot for Garnet and Amethyst. So we're gonna have all the crystal gems with us. Well, 
We might have two fusions, depending on how good I do this. Never fear! The great and lovable Paradot is here! I can only imagine the size of the of the gem who wielded this axe. Alright, so the warpad is right here. So everyone say goodbye to Greg and Peridot. See, we can actually warp straight there now. I never doubted us for a second. Let's put out some lights. She came out of nowhere. <laughs> That's it. This is enough to repair the terminal. Oh, she's gonna repeat her dialogue. And there, activate. Yay, so what does this say? Does it show where to fight Hesonite? Indeed. Looks like she's at the Sky Arena. Huh, that's a peculiar pace for her to man this one looks tough must be the great and terrible Excala crush are you talking about the boss yeah he's pretty cool <laughs> he has a mace and everything he can fly with the mace mm-hmm All right, the diamond this time was in the stomach. Perfect, and we got everybody on the team now. Kudos is Pearl's ability. Select the target to automatically build relationship points with. We should see how many they already have. But let's do this. And let's do Sardonyx. Darn it, that was flawless. I hope my um, advice helped you get Paradox. And if not, then I'm happy for you. <laughs> I've got just now let's thing. give a gift to Steven and Amethyst to boost up their relationship. Yes! What I'm we already got Smoky Quartz. It's in his hand this time. All right, he's targeting for Garnet. Let's see his shield break. We'll break the shield he has on his hand. Yes. Do another kudos for Garnet. Oh yeah, we're gonna have to definitely build up the relationship. Let's give him a gift. Oh, wrong people. Oh, good thing we have another gift. Oh, so if you guys don't see this comment by this viewer in Brazil. Smoky Quartz is called Quartzo Fume, which, which it means 
smoky quartz in English. That's cool. Alright, let's give him the old one two from Garnet. I want to uh, say Fumo's move. Show off. Smokey performs a trick so impressive that it grants a defense buff and regen effect to the team. Garn is actually going to need it. Now let's give a gift again to Pearl. It's a Garnet. There we go, we did it. Now that they're in perfect harmony, now we can fuse Sardonyx. Awesome, now we got two fusions. Okay, the diamond is in his hand. So viewers, remember when Excala Crush, or whatever you decide to name him, when he throws around his mace like that, you gotta block every time or else he's going to stun your character. So we actually need more stars, so I gotta wait. There we go. We can actually add more. what sardonics can do. Lovely hammer generates a quake that damages multiple enemies and lowers their attack. Or try our luck on her prize wheel. Alright, let's use Smokey's ability. My adoring fans. Smokey Serious will blow you away, knocks back, and damages all enemies. Sardonic's lovely hammer.
Let's try her prize wheel. Ah, oh, perfect. We did it, you guys! Sorry that took so long. <laughs> That should be up for your viewer. Thank you for your help. Just another level up. No Alright, so we unlocked a new ability for Garnet. It's Quake. Deals high damage to a large group of enemies around Garnet. So we can do that by... It'll be helpful. We can use a taunt on our enemies, which will bring them closer to her, and then we can use that. Now that's what I call a battle. Phew, I have to admit, Amethyst, that thing you did was pretty impressive. I know, right? I was all push, whoosh, bam, whack. <laughs> you weren't too bad yourself, P. <laughs> As I was saying. Oh yeah, where are we? Sky Arena? That's where the computer says she's currently located. So, shall we? Does she just stay there? Okay. So here's the other warp pad. Okay, so you can guys can get on the warp pad and then transfer to the ancient sky arena. Stop more adventure. If I'm not mistaken, we've been here before with Pearl in the show. This is where they get- this is where she trains Slavani or Steven and Connie when they're unfused. Yep, this is the place. Yep, there she is, viewers. Ah, Ahí está. Do it like you used to. Can't you access your memories <laughs> of this place? Come on. Just do it like you used to. Can you access your memory of this place? I'll take you back to the site of every battle we won on this miserable planet if that's what it takes. Try to remember things were so good back then. You were so much stronger. We were unstoppable. I can't bring you back until we get this right. A prism that doesn't want to be a weapon. What would they say if they saw that? Yes, the night. What's wrong with your prism? Oh, we're just activated for someone else, that's all. 
I agree, viewer. No, no, no! Bad form again! Oh, light, Steven. Why are you still thinking of that tiny human? How did it put these silly ideas into your refraction? You don't belong to him! You belong to me! No! We're here too. No! There she goes again. <laughs> really? Again? Ugh. Peridot, this is just like when we try to hunt you down, but worse. Cause, you know, she's actually threatening. <laughs> uh, thanks. Luckily, she doesn't know we're still tracking her. Though that's odd, she's returning to the strawberry battlefield. We were just there. This thing must need a reboot. No, wait. These coordinates, they're pointing to the exact location of the Pyramid Temple. You mean the one we blew up that one time? <laughs> That's the one. What's with you guys in blowing up ancient temples anyway? So, I guess we're heading back to that big crater. That's what that is? If you guys have kept up with the Steven series, I believe it was in the first season that they went to this temple. It was like the teacup rides. He noticed that and they blew it up. So if I'm not mistaken, that gem that they found there is the prism that we're dealing with here, which is a which is crazy. I like pointing out stuff, especially in like Steven. Well, in my shows, really. Phew. We sure have been working hard. I think it's time to give some more kudos. Amethyst, you're rocking it. Thanks, dude. Or nice pun, by the way. Totally intentional. Alright, so it looks like we're heading back to the Shawberry Battlefield. So there's another, there's two chests here, we already found one, but 
I'm just trying to see where this other one is located before we leave. Yeah, I don't want to really want to look around. <laughs> Steven, we're just like the heroes in your RPGs. I was just asked a question by one of my viewers. What's my favorite gem? My favorite gem has to be Opal, the fusion between Amethyst and Garnet for her outfit and also for her powers, for her uh, bow ability. I'm a big fan of archery. second favorite I think has to be Lapis Lazuli. I love the gem itself in real life. Where is she? Hmm, we do not have Ameth mm, Peridot for that. Okay, that definitely wasn't here before. Yep, let's check it out. Well, here's to go something. Great job today, Steven. Be on the lookout, you guys. Has a night might be near. I guess it's kind of interesting that another super secret py pyramid was here the whole time. So you guys really didn't know anything about this? Goodbye, viewer. See you. Catch you next time around 4 or 5 tomorrow when we do part 8. If you're willing to tune in. But bye. Adios. Yep. Like you said, super secret.
Usually when there's stones with cracks in them, they usually means they're breakable. Usually. This place is so mysterious and dungeony. Oh man, what are we gonna call it? <laughs> You're going to name it now, aren't you? Hmm. Hmm. How about? Secret Temple of Secrets. Yeah. Yep, that's the one. It's official. I don't even know where we just went. That's a mural of rose quartz against the prism. That's crazy. Do you guys see this bridge? Whoa. Here's oh, the night. look at this. Your new friends. Here to steal what's rightfully mine. The prism doesn't want to be with you. It doesn't want to be a weapon. You! You're the one who ruined everything. How did you override my prism? All my customized settings, all our hard-won battles. You've scrambled its memory. Hey, you orange fluffy... God. Yeah, we fried bigger fish than you. How about some of this? <gasps> no! No! Ah, the renegade pearl. Hesonite. We clashed back then. You forced us back, but you never stopped us. I'll never let you win. Yes, you will. We both know you're in over your head. How about instead of a fight, you just come along with me? I think I deserve a pearl by now. You know, I'm a bit of a legend. Even without my prism, I always win. No? Still want to fight? What a shame. Rose! Hey! Hesonite! Is this what you want? Ha! My head. 
don't worry, you're gonna be fine. Garnet, you're Sassfire. Steven! Where's Steven? I cannot see him. However, we are being accompanied by the next closest thing. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> One of the little light Stevens. And the others? <laughs> Never fear, Peridot is here. Yes. And look what I found. Yeah. The cheeseburger backpack. So Connie's with it right now. Steven? I can take us to the others. Ruby is with them. Okay, we can't waste any time. Let's find them. So let's follow Sassfire. Okay, nothing that we have will unlock this door right now. So let's go find something to unlock this door. Welcome back, viewer. So we've already talked with Hezonite. And something happened that we all separated. Even Garnet separated. She's not even Garnet right now. She's Sassfire and Ruby. If you can see right here, there she is. So we need to find the others and we need to get through this door. But first we need to find the keys for it. And that's what we're trying to figure out right now. Okay, so don't go through the lighter floor. <laughs> Speedy sneaks. Oh. No, sorry. <laughs> Alright, let's get a parry cannon going. Prepare to be amazed! Fascinating. Oh, 
Let's get her to stay. Perry Cannon over here by this guy. Alright, let's use Connie's new move. Sword Storm. Unleash a storm of attacks against a single target. Press the button faster for more attacks. Steven, I'm sorry! Damn. <laughs> What? 
So if you guys see on the p the pattern behind light, Steven, I'm guessing that's the pattern we have to take to the, so we don't fall or die or anything. So let's start on this one. Oh, perfect. There we go. Yeah, because if we stepped on one of those, yeah, we would have died. Well, not died, but teleported. That's fine. Okay, so if you guys pay attention to the compass in the middle of the room that has like north is blue, east is green, west is yellow, and south is purple, we'll get through this. So we need to go east, so take this green portal. Now if we take that pink portal, we hit south and there's nothing south. So let's take the yellow portal, actually yellow portal, take us back. Let's try the pink one. Ah! So as soon as you go through that pink one, let's see about going, trying to rush into that green one. Oh man! Ow! Ugh. Okay. <laughs> so this has to be rather quick. So let's plan this out. Pink is south, so we're gonna hit that green teleporter south of us. Green is east, so we hit that green teleporter, we're gonna go to the, tele the other green teleporter east of us. East of that green teleporter. We go east again, we're gonna go through the yellow one. Then we're just gonna go west. So don't take the yellow one, take the blue one instead then. So green to blue then, because blue will head north. And then we'll be on the next pillar that's on directly across from us right now. So pink, green, green, blue. And then we'll figure it out from there. Oh, no way. Oh, oh. Man. Ah. Hmm. This is gonna be hard. Let's let Peridot do it. Hey! Look, yeah, because if we head to that... There we go, we made it. Now from here... We gotta go through the pink one. No, wait. From here you we get this, tre this treasure chest. Give it to me! Immunity badge, 25% to resist all negative effects. And we can actually add our points right now to Connie. We got a new upgrade for her, Sworn Protector. When Connie initiates Protect on a teammate, they gain a temporary health regain effect. Regen effect. That's right. It's a lovable paradox. So let's put this twenty-five chance to resist all negative effects on this Connie. Come in handy. We're a little stuck here, but not too stuck. We're gonna have to go through that green teleporter south of us. So in order to do that, we're gonna go through this pink teleporter that's to the left of us. Right here. And then once we teleport to the green, blue, and yellow teleporters, we're gonna go left. So another green. So pink and green. 
There we go. Also, another helpful hint is to jump before you jump in through the force of the first teleporter. Then you have enough time to sort of get into the next one when you're in midair. There we go, there's the key. The ancient thingamajig. <laughs> Used to open ancient door, of course. And I'm guessing this white teleporter teleports us back to the center of the room. Yep. Alright, now off to find the yellow one. The yellow key. We need two keys to open this door. Paradox ability in this game is really dope. Um, what's so funny, Paradox? Aren't you excited? We're so into grill this time. No sitting around at home. Aren't you worried about Steven and the others? Um. Worried with us on the case, we'll find him and then we'll show that Claudy has a knife that the new crystal gems mean business. All right. <laughs> yeah, I like the sound of that. <laughs> Paradox. That is funky. Ancient thingamajig again. Used to open the ancient door, of course. So this is the gold one. We already have the silver one. We're good to go. Paradox is so determined. No feel good tea. Actually, we never searched through this room. I'm just gonna search it for my own curiosity. Let's use Paradox Metal Powers to move this thing over here to make like a bridge of some sort. And then we move it again over here. Uh, 
So beware of the hammers. <laughs> If you time it just right, you should be able to get. You should be able to. gotten this far in the game I think I should be able to oh there we go I am thanks for the confidence <laughs> Something is definitely on the other side of this that they don't want us to get. Just keep jumping back and forth when it starts blinking, you know, when to jump off. Have to heal Perry soon. Another I have broke we got a schematic only for a second upgrade. So this is for a Paradox tablet, and this is for upgrading it to level 2. So this is the first one I've gotten of this type. That's pretty dope. Alright, back to the main room to open that ancient door. Little light, Steven. believe it was once again to the new crystal gems to save the day. I knew it wouldn't be long before it came to this again. <laughs> How lucky are they to have us. Peridot. Um, yes. 
best to focus. Wow. Oh, right. Let's go. Come on, guys. Time to find our friends. This way. Not much further now. I love doing Sapphire's voice. It's so calm. All right, you guys. So I'm gonna stop here for today. We've been streaming now for I think about an hour and a half. You guys can catch us tomorrow with a new stream for part 8. We're going to pick up where we were leaving off today. I usually stream about 4 or 5 for my younger viewers who get out of school during the weekdays. Um, yeah, and you guys can look at the channel. There are more videos on the channel. Um, more streams. I've, I've been streaming since the beginning of the game. So if you guys have any questions or you're stuck at a part before this then totally go to the youtube channel check out the streams i think i have it on the playlist steven universe save the light so go ahead and look at that gameplay i also do other games like warframe dco eso which is skyrim um titanfall overwatch a bunch of other stuff and we do like tutorials or or just playing gameplay or how to's um we have a lot of helpful videos up there if you guys want to check that out but thank you for joining us and we'll be back tomorrow around four or five thank you for watching you guys bye